sometimes I'll call in and there's no appointments available. So we'll have to book out like two, three weeks in advance. Pet grooming businesses say they're also struggling to meet the demand. They say there is a major lack of groomer training. Case Area 3's Maricela Dela Cruz spoke to one business owner that has had to turn away new customers. Yes, that's right. This business owner in South Sacramento says that she has been turning away new customers and says that she can probably start getting some new ones next month, although she says she's already pretty much booked through mid-August. Yeah, you're a good boy. Yes, you are. After 20 years as a pet groomer, I told new customers, no, I couldn't take anymore, and it made me feel really bad. Bobby De La Torre is turning away new customers as the pet grooming industry is overwhelmed with appointments and not enough professionals to serve them. I do between 10 to 14. I try not to do more than that because I want to do the work right. We were doing up to 20 during the COVID because a lot of places closed. Okay, let me see. De La Torre's family-run business is open from 8 a.m. to 3.30. But even as they take less customers, that schedule looks a lot more like six o'clock. That's because grooming takes anywhere between two to four hours per pet. We have to strip them before we can bathe them. Then they come back and get reshaped. <laughs> so that, that's a, a process. I don't think I've ever experienced it like this. Antonio Morez has three dogs and doesn't recall ever dealing with overbooked pet grooming businesses. Sometimes I'll call in and there's no appointments available. So we'll have to book out like two, three weeks in advance. Um, and since I do have several dogs, I want to get them all in at the same time. And some other options that uh, pet owners have are those self-serve dog wash businesses. Uh, I spoke to one business here in Midtown and they say that unlike pet grooming businesses, they are not overbooked. Live in Midtown, Maricela mm. de la Cruz, KCRA. All right, interesting. Maricela, thank you.